I finally have a picture of one of these things to prove that they're real. Now all of you that are new to this topic of the Darrow, I had an encounter with one of these things when I lived in Texas and I made a video about it called Hollow Earth My Encounter with the Darrow. And basically it came in my room it, uh, right when I was putting a cigarette out in the ashtray it twisted my arm behind my back and he put some kind of device to the side of my head and I saw this door open up in the corner of the room and a shadow uh, demon came into that uh, doorway but anyway you can go watch the video for all the details but ever since I had that encounter I knew they were real because I was not asleep and I have a lot of people say well you were sleeping and I wasn't asleep I smoked a cigarette and I put the cigarette out in the ashtray and the cigarette was still there when I uh, after this encounter was over uh, you know and something intervened to uh, protect me well ever since that encounter I'd been on a quest uh, and I like I was 21 when that happened and when I was 32 I picked this book up and read it and it was a book about hollow earth and it had some stories in it and there was a drawing of a darrow in it and I couldn't believe it because it was the exact same creature that was in my room because I never knew what to call it you know I, I just thought it was some kind of being some devil or some kind of something you know I didn't know but anyway after I was 32 and I found that book and I saw the picture I began to wonder what it was because it said it was a darrow in the book and I I knew that the guy who wrote the story uh, or turned in his story to this magazine was telling the truth well I had someone from Australia send me a video and I I looked through the video but my editor having just a, about a four inch screen over in the side I'd never really spotted this picture and someone basically freeze frame this picture out of uh, this morphing image that was behind the curtains hiding in the bedroom and that, that video is called something like a demon hiding uh, in a real demon hiding in the bedroom uh, you, you can search through and find it but this picture is what a Darrow looks like and they can look different uh, now I've got a, another picture that uh, kind of looks more like it does and a lot of my paintings that I've done uh, look more kind of like the one I saw but they uh, get more and more deformed the longer they live according to Richard Shaver who encountered these things and spent even time with them supposedly in the uh, caverns because they live subterranean but anyway this is the picture uh, it opened its eyes. Uh, I gone. I went back and looked, and you can see it blinking as it's morphing behind this curtain, kind of phased out of dimension a little bit. But when it opened its eye, you can see both eyes, and you can see the long nose. And this is a real picture. I know it is. When I saw it, this particular freeze frame, I had cold chills run across my arms. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? because that was a real encounter for me and it and it really uh, it scared me to tell you you know it, I told, tell you the truth it scared me and at that time I didn't know about rebuking anything or I didn't know that the Lord would protect you and and things like that but, and the Lord did protect me so you can go watch the the hollow earth my encounter with the Darrow video and then go watch the real demon hiding in the bedroom click the little circle thing up there in the right corner and I'll put uh, the Daryl playlist and the, uh, all those videos uh, for you to go check them out. Anyway, told you, a real Daryl right here. And when the dude sent the video, he said, possible Daryl footage. He believed he caught a Daryl in, in his room. And plus he had a lot of other stuff going on because people were practicing black magic against him. And um, so he was a targeted individual. And, and he had some serious things going on. You'll see in that video. God bless, and I'll see you on the next video.